Hello everybody and welcome back to the salon. This is Wendy's Pet Salon. I'm Wendy and this is my little salon at home. Look who's arrived. It's a little Brucey. A little Brucey bonus at the end of the day. Oh, look at him. He still looks quite nice, doesn't he? Yeah, don't you? So he's just gonna have a bath to tidy. Oh, he's so gorgeous. Hmm? You have a bath to tidy and do your feet and your nails. So we're in the bath and his mum said that he smelt like marshmallows. I can't remember what shampoo that I used on him. I'm thinking it would have been the sensitive one. I should really look back on my own video. <laughs> Well, I'm going to use a little bit of Dirty Beastie uh, today, which is like strawberry pineapple and pear kind of. It's a very deodorising smell uh, and I love it. I am running quite short of it now. Um, but I'm going to use the wall, uh, which I love. I also, the wall, I like the, the aloe vera and also the oatmeal one is very, very nice. So. So we're just gonna, it shouldn't take too long. <laughs> Thank you. My coffee. Um, <laughs> just look at that face. So I'm gonna give him a MD10 facial which I think I would have used last time because you've got like a little bit of a little bit of stain around your eyes, a little on your mouth. Oh, yeah. Yes. I'm just give you that. Because um, Yorkies especially, they build up a lot of this um, eye bogies, duck muck. It wells onto the face. Um, so the face needs a really good soak. So, you give that a good massage in. Um, so we'll do um, two shampoos. Just gonna use my little pot. Put some in there and some water as well. And um, I might have mentioned on the video that I found a little lump on his bottom last time, well the, the first time I did him, um, <clears throat> and it turns out that it was his anal glands, his anal glands are quite high up so um, it looked like a little lump there, but it seems to have gone now, bit done, done your mum, yes, so you would have felt better for that, because you have a little bit of stuff stuck to your bottom didn't you which we had to soak off with the um the groomer's glue uh, but you don't have any muck on your bottom this time so that's good mum just wants to keep him all nice and tidy yeah because unfortunately he, he left his down he lost his dad a few uh, a few days after I groomed him. Um, so he's been a little bit sad, so we'll give you a nice little pamper. Okay, to cheer you up. Okay, can't we? Yes. You can't see him, can you? He is down here. There he is. You're there, aren't you? He's 
to move the camera down so that we can see you without losing my camera. Sometimes it falls out of this little holder, doesn't it? It does. So that's the second shampoo. So you're now just squeaky clean. It's smelling fresh. cutest little face we have. So I'm going to get him out of the bath now. I'll give him a little bit of a blast here um, so it's not dripping wet. Um, just on low. You put your little happy hoodie on. She's nice and warm on the radiator. Give him a little bit of a blast and then I'll get him on the um, on the big table. tidy up to keep keep you all neat and stuff his body isn't too bad at all um i'll just stand you that way there's a good boy uh, so i'm going to tidy up all these little ends um and it's all been brushed and combed through he's got no knots at all this time um and i'm just going to tailor i'm just going to tailor the outside and the inside. I'm going to do around his feet, inside his pads, do his nails and all under here that's where I was sort of dangling. I'm just going to neaten up around there and then we'll do your face as well because he was very short last time. So here I'm going to tailor all all here. Now I could do it with my straights um, but I'm going to use it with my little fluffers because I find that the, the fluffers which are the piano teeth um, these are, these actually are ab fab. <laughs> I've been doing a, um, obviously things with the, the book review and um, I'm mentioning the scissors for ab fab scissors these are from there um, and they give you a nice um how can i explain sometimes you feel with the sort of fine fluffy hair that when you go with your scissor it kind of you kind of miss quite a bit um these actually cut it but need leave a nice soft natural edge to it 
Um, so I kind of, I'm going to just lift it up then. I'm just going to go over and take the edge and just follow it down and just neaten it up. Um, and oh, like with the chunkers, uh, sometimes hair gathers on chunkers and things like that. Um, I do find that it doesn't, they don't hold too much hair on the scissors that you have to keep knocking it off all the time. Um, but it gives you a nice sort of soft natural finish. And as you can see, it's actually grabbing the hair, whereas sometimes with the straights, normal scissors you cut and you you slide off you slide off the hair but this, this actually grabs it and cuts the hair so i'm literally just going to tailor all these ends in sort of comb it, lift the hair into place, um, these are what you call a drop coat type of hair so if I was to lift it too much and then cut it, um, it's not going to have the same effect as a poodle coat so you kind of just with the drop coat you sort of move it to where it would naturally fall and then trim it you can lift it up with the comb you can lift it with the comb slightly and take the ends off because sometimes you can't always grab the see the coat that you, you actually want to trim. But if you move it out slightly, you'll be able to see the edge better. So then when you comb it in, it sits a bit neater. So you'll see, I'll just put my comb in there and I'm gonna lift it slightly away and then take the edge off and then comb it back in. Oh. Uh, same with the inside, just sort of lift it out lift it out and away and then I just tailor the edge. Uh, I'm going to do the little trimmer, little arco trimmer inside his little pad there. Make that nice and short. Neat inside his foot. Again, a bit more for fluffers. And then when I'm doing around my foot, don't look at your nails. Well, just tip your nails slightly because they're not too bad. And just tightly take the tiny ends. So when you take the tiny ends, it kind of makes your foot sit neater as well. So that's what I normally do: back, front, front, back. So not much on the back. So I'm just going to take the toe, edge of the toe first. So I put the top, place the foot down, pull the hair from side to side. And then I'm going to match it up with the front. So that way I get a nice round foot rather than you doing the sides and making it pointy at the front and then taking the point off. I find that I get a nicer rounder foot doing it that way. And it is just a case of removing the hair. And tailoring it so it's all nice and neat. You 
if you were having a bit of trouble with a bit of flyaway hair, you could use some um, scissor mist and just take a little tight. This comes out quite fast if you don't do it gently. So you can just put that in and it just helps the hair sit and hold it in place while you're trimming it. Starting to neaten up now. Good boy. Again. I did use I use my straights around the foot. spiky ends we're just neaten up that's okay good boy you see there's some there's some ends there Stress, it's okay. Hey, don't stress, it's okay. Like I say, you can lift your comb, lift your hair with your comb, and just take the edge off and then comb it back in. Sometimes it can be hard to grab if you don't lift it away. Good boy. Do the same with your foot again. Take the hair on the inside. Beautiful pass. Good boy. Nails again. Your outside nails grow quite a lot, don't they? Because his toe, his toe there is set further up on his foot, set further back, so it's got farther to grow, hasn't it? So just the way his toes set. So back foot. Making a racket. Oh yeah, making a racket. Mm -hmm. Good boy. So again, there's not terribly much to take her foot down. These tiny rose lines are fantastic for feet. You can get Really small ones. Nice neat foot. See that looks a bit heavier there to me, so I'm gonna lift it, put my comb in. I'm going to lift it away. Might as well. Let's go.
And if you wanted a really smooth look, you can get your little fine, these little, the little pammy ones, little fine blenders. And go over with your blenders. Now these are reversible as well. So I can, I can get a little bit closer. I always find I can get in a bit closer when it's on a curve. So I can use a curve on that side. I'll get a little bit closer to the leg. So I can go down, but I can also reverse it. It is reversible. It's just that bit there's broke off because there was two. There was one there, one there. So there no, they are reversible. <laughs> Turn that to the three, which is the longest setting. I'm just going to clean up around your man area. Don't look so worried. It's okay. Okay, Mr. Bruce. So, just keep brushing, keep looking. Do that inside that part a bit better. There we go. Good boy. So that looks a lot, lot tidier now, doesn't it? You can push the skin underneath here and it will pop out the hair from underneath and then my fingers are there in the way and I can just safely blend the hair off there there we go so that looks lovely on that side There, that side. And then we'll look at the other side now, shall we? It's okay. And you see now, I'm going to tailor all those little bits up as well. That's okay. That's okay. Good boy. Good boy. and tidy. Okay, let's do this leg. And look, I have them inside that part. Uh, I found use the I did use the tiny one last time because there was a little bit of a knot there that I couldn't get out but I can just as easy use the small the mini trimmer as well. So let's just move you 
Now we want you there. Lift all that hair out. And we'll just get our little fluffers and just take that edge off. Good boy. And then we'll look at this leg here. And this leg. I'm going to hold his bits out of the way so I don't catch them. Good boy. Good boy. And then let's just take this bits of hair from around your bottom. Let's just move you back a bit. Move you back. Good boy. Where's my little moustache? Hold them nice and still so they don't dangle. Because if they dangle, they're going to get in the way and I might just get them, might I? I don't want to do that. Okay, move it out. Switching it out. Nice and neat and tidy. Good boy. Good boy. That was my knee. Yeah, like I was saying with the uh, with the drop coat, it grow. It's their coat falls. It's long and it and it's flowing, rather than um, a curly coat. When you when you uh, straighten the curly coat, lifts up and it stays where it was. This this coat falls in a different way. It's okay. Tips are oh, you don't really have much tips. It's not so bad, really. Let's stay and pull straight. Home in, and I can lift that hair like that, and then get out with my scissors. Maybe it looks a bit awkward, but sometimes we've got to adapt our skills around you, haven't we? Get 
the job done in the end, don't we? That's a good boy. see little bits from different angles. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. So you can lift out his body hair. Get my little blenders. Just take the end off and then sit it back in. All these flicky bits and I can lift out and then comb back in, lift out, comb back in. Good boy. Here's your evening unwind routine. Alexa, stop. <laughs> he wants me to unwind. What do you think? I can't play music on the issue. Can we? Good boy, so just do his little pad. We're nearly onto the head, aren't we? Let's take them, take the dew claw, because they're the ones that don't run on the floor and wear down the same as the other ones. Tiny tips, tiny tips. There we go. Right, let's do this leg. Let's do this leg. There's a good boy, there's a good boy, you got it, you got it, well done. Good boy, good boy. Stay, stay. Well done, you are good. I'm needing a pull of this, see you. Good boy.
this way. Good boy. that way if you prefer that way you can go the other side of the table you prefer that way we can go this way attachment on there and just neaten up the up his neck a little bit. Yes. If I remember rightly, he was better with the, the clippers. He was happy with the clippers around his head a bit better. But there we go. I'm just going to run this three over your head. Good boy. Just to give myself a light to play with. Because I think you preferred the puppies around your face, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Good boy. Let's do your little face. Let's do your little face. Just take that hair out of there, okay? Good boy. It's okay. Okay. 
Okay. side down. Good boy. You're supposed to lift that leg up. Oh, it does not have hair on your leg. Good boy. Let's get that hair from there. Good boy. Right. Nice and neat. Okay. Clever boy. Clever boy. Let's just put this round here now. So I can see you. Have a look. Oh, dirty nerdy. Good boy. Clever boy. It's okay. You want to sit down?
Good boy. Good boy. Yeah, a bit better for your head today.
So it's loads better for your face and stuff today, aren't you? It's very good for your face and stuff. She doesn't like you to touch it too much, do you? to sit there. Well, you've got a very cute face again, hasn't he? Who's sat in there? Who's sat there? <coughs> you good boy. Are you good boy? Yeah. You want a treat? You didn't like treats last time, did you? You didn't like treats last time. Oh. You gonna take it? Oh yeah. Oh good boy, taking treats. That's good. Oh clever boy. Mm. Oh you like these, don't you? Good boy. You can have it all if you like. Good boy. I'm just gonna sharpen up his face a little bit and then I'm gonna call your mum. I message your mum. Yeah. So that's his lovely little face. So that was just a little bit of brusiness. Having a bit of brucey bonus, aren't we? His tail's still growing, so oh. I'm just gonna give that a little bit of a, a comb through. got hair stuck in it now. That's why I have to keep cleaning my table because hair gets stuck in it. Good boy. I'll just maybe just tailor that a little bit. Just a little the ends, just while it's growing. There, there we go. Back for the tiny for Bruce. Ain't it? Yes. Let's turn you around that way. Turn you around that way. You're all messed up now because you've been sitting on the table. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. It's okay. Let's take that off. There's a good boy. Take it off. There. There. Is that better? Is that better for you? Brucey bonus. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> What's this? You want this? Oh, it's bigger than you. Mm.